Good morning and namaste. This is Jewel from Goddess Creative. I have a new reading for you today. And this reading is done on the 12th of October 2020. And this reading is for Ave. Lend. So Ave Lend project. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So and remembering this is not financial advice. Do your own research and due diligence and everything before investing in any cryptocurrency. Um, but this is a lovely reading. Really, really, really nice. So I really liked it. Um, okay, so what do we have? So we get a nice long lifespan with this one. So I get that that Ave Lend is a good investment, Spirit said, and it is a nice um, lifespan of seven years for the investment, longer for the working. So I'm I'm starting to delve more in questions in that area now because I'm starting to gather that some will be around but the investment will just maybe not you won't be making money past that timeline something like that I'm not quite sure um, but that's what I got so I'm just giving you what I got so but anyway seven years that's a long way off it's a good investment spirit says um, yes I do think that um, this one is first cut out I get in the now position is the page of swords. So the page of swords energy is thoughtful, intellectual, it's a young energy being a page, young curious energy, seeking truth and justice above all else, which is beautiful. This is exactly what we want. You know, in something like this kind of project, which is um, to do with, you know, moving away from the banks and lending funds. So we, we, we you know, obviously we want truth and justice above all else in something like this uh, project. So it is a youthful team um, that communicates well in order to stay in the truth of the situation. So that's really beautiful energy. Really, really nice for this project. Um, so pages could also represent news to alert the truth. So I get that it's a good, nice energy for this project. So that's really, really nice. So moving into the December, January timeline. And I do get the Four of Cups. Yeah. So this Four of Cups, this is in relation to the price. Because I do not get, I get that it will get to its all-time high this year. But that's not huge. It, I, I don't get that it will get past its all-time high this year. Um... But, but in early January it does, right? So it's just that, yeah, so this card is, is a, it's for this timeline, is a card of withdrawal and dissatisfaction. It's, it's a card of indifference, basically. So, but I get that this card is in relation to the price. It's not really in relation to the team. So I don't get, yeah, I do not get it's the team's, team's energy though. Although yes, um, I do get that some frustration when you look around at others in this timeline. So that they will be feeling a bit of, um, yeah, dissatisfaction and perhaps frustration. And even investors will, when you look around, I'm talking about the timeline and the price compared to others. That's all I'm saying here. Um, so 
is nothing wrong yeah so it's, it's just a bit of indifference and a little bit of frustration energy because the price yes it does get back to its all-time high which is lovely um but compared to what i see for some other ones could be a bit frustrating that's all i'm trying to say in this in this timeline of december january but woohoo look what comes in for first second quarter this one absolutely beautiful this energy so i get the nine of coins nine of pentacles and yes we see movement now in this timeline finally so that's nice that is the first second quarter 2021 we are starting to see nicer moves and we would want to see this by then otherwise i would be thinking something seriously wrong um but we are this is the this is this confirms it and um it's just it amazes me because you know i first as you, as you know might be aware i first have a conversation with spirit without even knowing what the cards are and i can see where the movement is i can see the slowed and it's reflected in the price of the movement like the the coin requester always gets the prices and the price move movements and how they move in the timeline and what they're going to be so i can see slow movement and all that before i've even laid the cards and then I do, once I've got my, have my conversation with spirit and I've got my price points, I will then shuffle the cards, continuing, continuing my conversation with spirit. And I just don't lay cards. I only take jumpers. Jumpers is meaning when the cards are, sh you're shuffling the cards like so. I'll only take cards that are jumping out, that'll jump out. Sometimes they jump jump out in a whole blocks like a like a group of cards. Of course, you you know some some readers will take the whole lot. I don't believe in doing that. That's when I stop and divine again with my pendulum, That's, and I ask, is this the right card? Is this the correct card for lend? For example, lend in this timeline. This is how I get my tarot cards. If you weren't sure. I wanted to highlight that because I had somebody last week asking, uh, she, you know, she doesn't show how she shuffles her cards. I don't um, because I would be adding 15 minutes on to this reading if I did because I'm very, very particular how the cards come out. For me, they've got to be jumper cards from the um, tarot deck mm -hmm. and then even then I divine on them again. So they are making sense. And that's why when I get something like, I got something like this for this timeline and then something like this from Spirit in this timeline, it just confirms my price points. It just, it's, it astounds me how um, it coincides just out of the blue. And that's why I feel and I know the information I'm getting is really is from Spirit because it's just that double up confirmation for me. So yeah, I really like it. So coming back to this beautiful nine of pentacles and look at her and her all her abundance and glory. Look at all the pentacles around her. So beautiful. So absolutely beautiful. So this confirms this timeline. This also confirms this beautiful energy in this project. This team is working hard. They're ticking all their boxes. Pentacles confirms that as well, earth energy. It is all about earned rewards are here, right? And this will be reflected for both the team and the investors. It's fruits of labor is what it is. It, it is about they've worked hard and it certainly is self-sufficiency. They got here by working hard. That's what this means. And this is taking charge of the future it is a reflection of abundance showing in this timeline so it's really beautiful i really like it you know it's blue skies look at that all those pentacles all the rewards fruit of labor so i really really like that and that's just lovely to see um, that confirms my prices in 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 this timeline of first second quarter 2021 so we do do like that a lot so yes 
Um, I think this is a really good project. I really like it. I didn't know anything about it. I'm not invested in it. Of course, do your own research, due diligence, check all the fundamental analysis out, see what the team's doing before you invest in any project. But I actually quite liked it a lot and I enjoyed seeing the energy of this project and I enjoyed um, yeah, what I got from it. It was really good. So yes, let me just do a little check. Is this the correct energy for lend, Ave, lend, going forward, going forward, lend, 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 going forward? Yes, is this a good investment? A good investment, lend. Good, solid investment. Stable and solid investment. Lend, lend, lend. Yes. And do you see my pendulum just starts to move faster and wider, which is even more confirmation for me. So yeah, Ooh, okay, <laughs> I just feel spirit go straight through me. Okay, thank you. I love and appreciation of your communication and connection always. Okay, and thank you to you also for watching. Thank you for your support. Hit the like button if you like this energy. Um, yeah, beautiful. Nothing, nothing wrong with this. I think it's really exciting. We should all be in so much appreciation for the abundance that is about to come forth. You know, you know, to be in it now, to have the opportunity, you won't be having this opportunity next year. Me sitting here this time next year, highly doubtful. <laughs> um, yeah, I will be doing um, all sorts of other things. But, but I'm just saying, yeah, we should be appreciative and thankful for what's happening, for the unfolding of this energy, for the unfolding of, of being able to be in early. Um, yeah. Yes. Magic made manifest is what I say. Um, okay, I won't rattle on any further. Um, thank you very much for watching. If you like my videos, hit the like button. If you want to request a coin request or get my crypto report, um, go to my website. Yes, and love and appreciation always. Namaste.